What's up guys, Spin Firearms here, and this is my Walther PPS M2, and that was a Vetter Pocket Locker holster. Just wanted to demonstrate how nice those holsters come off in your pocket when you use that push dab. Also, it has the claw to hook, so shout out to Vetter, they make awesome pocket holsters. That is my go-to carry when I'm pocket carrying. Now, before we get started, please hit the like button, please drop a comment, drop an emoji, I don't care what it is, I would really appreciate it, it really helps the channel. But as of lately, this Walther PPS M2 has been my work carry. Prior to that was my FN503, which I just got back, so which I'll probably be switching right back to. And as you can see, once again, another Vetter pocket locker holster. That is how I carry while at work. But if you've ever pocket carried, you know what comes with it. And it's dirt, it's grime, it's gunk, it's wood shavings, it's cement, you know, dust, insulation, all that sort of stuff, right? And your firearm sort of takes a beating and gets real dirty and gunked up and it just comes with it, right? But at least you have something on you. And as long as you maintain it and clean it and make sure it runs, then you shouldn't have many issues, right? But one thing someone put me on to was this right here. It's called Ammo Armor, right? Basically, it just does exactly what it says. It protects your mag. This right here is for my Smith & Wesson bodyguard. I literally just took this, threw it in my pocket um, when I was carrying it um, to the movie theater today. Had my bodyguard in my other pocket. Very easy, very simple, easy to put in your pocket. Um, and this right here is for my Walther PPSM2, so this has also been in my pocket. And I think if you buy three of them, they're like $30, uh, $10 a piece, they send you a fourth one. So you get four of them for $30, and they're pretty much interchangeable. This will work for my CZ P10M. Um, I think it works for my Shields. It works for my Glock 43. Basically all single stacks. And the one I just showed you basically works for the LCP, the Spectrum, the Beretta Pico, you know, any um, single stack 380, which is really nice. So you can use these. You can buy a couple of them and use them with a lot of your firearms, which I really, really like. Now, the one thing I noticed is what is the point, um, which is obviously to keep gunk and lint out of your magazine because that can cause a lot of things. It can cause primer issues. It can just cause feeding issues. It can cause just buildup and gunk that will ruin your magazines and your firearms reliability because majority of your reliability comes from your magazines. But the number one issue I have with it is how do you remove this, right? You're in a gunfight and you have a malfunction and you need to clear it with a new mag because that mag is the issue. You go to get this out of your pocket, this just doesn't like slide off. So you, you got to train and get used to, you know, pushing it off with your fingers or you're going to have to go get some cover somewhere, which at that point, chances are it's no longer self-defense. So that I didn't understand fully, but I still like having an extra mag on me. And on top of that, I like it being protected. Now, over time, I'm going to train and learn to get better with how to remove these properly. Um, I'm guessing you would use something like this. You know, because you're basically going to have one hand and you're going to drop it and then load, right? So it could be a little hard, but that is ammo armor. Absolutely love these things and I'm still still carrying them as I figure them out because I don't want to carry just a backup mag where it's going to get all gunked up and dirty and jammed up with stuff. I want something to protect it. So this is how I've been carrying, even though I'm not the best with it. That's ammo armor for your magazines. Protect your firearms. Maintenance is the number one thing. Preventative maintenance and making sure your firearms clean is the number one thing for reliability when pocket carrying. Thanks for watching guys